Yo, what's good everybody, man? We are back with another day of Doula, another day being charged up, and today we're gonna simulate until Steph Curry's three-point record is broken in NBA 2K24. So we are here in current day, this uh, current season, and if we go to the league history, NBA records, all-time three-pointers made is Stephen Curry with 3,390 at the start of the season. Right now, he's probably at like 3,500. Bro's going crazy. He's having an MVP type of season. He might actually win MVP, uh, which might be crazy. But I'm going to create a player, start him as a rookie this season, and I'm going to simulate until we break his record and see if we can also complete what Curry's done. If I can win MVPs, win chips, we'll get into all that in a minute. Before we get into it, make sure you drop like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and also follow me on Instagram, bro. We're trying to hit 5K followers over there, and I post on my story. Soon, I'm hitting the basketball court, hitting the gym. I'm going to clip some like highlights of me hitting threes and stuff. So if you want to see if I can really hoop, which I think I'm a pretty good shooter, I'll post on my Instagram story. All right, let's get right into it, bro. So I made a character, a uh, creative player. His name is Dula Curry. It, it is kind of glazing, I'm not going to lie. I couldn't think of a more creative last name. So uh, Dula Curry is 21 years old, and I start him off as an 89 overall, but I'm not touching him. So looking at his player, here's what I did so far uh, to give us the best chance to break, you know, his record. What I did is uh, for his attributes, I made sure he had maxed out three-pointer and maxed out mid-range shot, okay? Obviously, that's the most important thing. But what's also just as important is his tendency to shoot threes. So I made sure whenever it comes to shooting threes, he has a tendency to do it at the max, whether it be from contested, whether it's a transition pull up three, I'm gonna shoot it. And then when it comes to freelance, uh, he's gonna shoot it 100% of the time. So the point is I'm setting it up to where he shoots as much as possible. So what we're gonna end up doing is we're gonna add him to the league, but like this, I'm gonna click on him and copy the free agency. And hey, whatever happens, happens. I'm not controlling what team he lands on. So let's just simulate uh, through the first game. And let's see if Dula Curry has been picked up by any team. No, he's still a free agent. Let's simulate a couple more games. I mean, no one is going to pass up on this generational talent. Like, there's no way. And Dula Curry is still a free agent. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Imagine no one takes him. Yo, how is he still a free agent? Real talk. It's been two weeks now. All right, I'm going to simulate to November 18th, current, current day. Or no, the 17th. No, it's actually the 16th. It's already November 16th. Oh my God, bro. Time is flying. I'm not going to lie. November is flying. But, uh... Dula Curry, how? Bro, what? What? Oh, probably because I have all user teams set up for, I'm stupid. I'm actually, I might be one of the dumbest people of all time. I have to make it automated. I'm actually stupid. So let's try this again. I already lost out on valuable times, uh, valuable games where he could have hit threes. So I already shot myself in the foot like Plastico Burris. Burris back in 2008, I believe is when he did it. But Dula Curry is now signed to the Boston Celtics. Oh my God, a point guard that could shoot. That's exactly what they needed. Uh, okay, well, that's 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 how the cookie crumbles. That was a super white phrase I just used. But, all right, 90 overall as a rookie, right? He's a great prospect. And um, here's how it's going to be. So his first couple games that he's played, he's attempting 28 threes and he made 12 of them. Okay, so let's look at what the challenge for this video is. Obviously, it's to break Curry's record, but also be better than Curry. So Curry, throughout his 15-year NBA career, has won a total of four chips and two MVPs. We need to do that before the end of the video. That's part of the challenge. Um, so we need to win four rings, two MVPs, and then I'll hop into some three-point contests in the video, obviously win those. But also, we have an advantage, or maybe we don't, it depends. But Curry, early in his career, got injured a lot. So those first few seasons, he only hit 100, 150, right? If we aim for, let's see, Curry averages about, let's call it 300 threes made a season, right? Because, yeah, some years he was out due to injury. So we'll say 300 three-pointers per season. Over 12 years is all we really need. We should break this record. Granted, we don't get injured. So keep in mind, we're also on a team with a lot of uh, ball-dominant players. So that's going to also play an impact. We're not controlling our own team or, like, the face of a franchise, which means less shots for us. But the rotation looks like this. is me, Derek White, Tatum, Horford, Porzingis while uh, Jalen Brown is recovering. So I feel like there's no better start to win a ring than with the Celtics team. So let's sim this first season and uh, see what we could do. And for you guys, I want you guys to comment down below. Out of all the NBA players in the league right now, right, whether it be rookies or whatever it is, who do you think has the best chance to break the record currently in the NBA? Um, I really don't know. Because the thing is, James Harden is the closest player, but there's no way he's hitting 700 threes. He's, he's washed, you know, that's, that's the truth. Damian Hood is over a thousand behind Curry, so that's not gonna happen. Uh, obviously, LeBron and Clay, like, there's no chance of that. So, 
it has to be a younger guy that's starting off like right now that shoots a lot of threes which makes me curious does trey young have a shot so trey's already he's in year number six right now and how many threes has he made per season about 200 yeah so he has a chance he's at a thousand currently in six years so if he plays 18 years maybe but i don't know i, I feel like trey young might have the best chance out of anyone in the league right now but y'all comment down below who you think i paused the simulation mid-season just out of curiosity and as you can see we got injured bro a high left ankle sprain you know, I swear I did not copy uh, Curry's tendencies or player DNA at all. I made this completely from scratch. So the fact that he also is going through an ankle sprain, that's not good. But so far this season, he's made, bro, 100 threes, but we're only in, in February. So I'm not going to lie. That's not bad considering we started off late. We're missing time due to injury. I feel like we're going to break this record, bro. I think it'll happen. There is a chance it doesn't. There really is a chance it does not happen. Wow. Wow. That's the first time... Okay, so look, it's November. It's been almost two months of simulations, I would say. It's the first time I've seen LeBron win MVP at age 39. That's the oldest MVP, obviously, in the history of anything in life. Uh, most valuable person at that point. So, I mean, everyone's valuable in their own way. Some people aren't. Some people really are not worth a damn. Uh, Victor Mbanyama wins Rookie of the Year. Chris Paul, sixth man. Okay. El Prince, Sun Gun, most improved. <laughs> a 2K23 throwback, if you will. And Tatum is a clutch player of the year. I will take that. Is Dula Curry on this list? Uh, no, but Steph Curry is. Steph Curry averaged 30 this season. So, he made how many threes? He made a total of 400. You know, his record was 402. He just tied it. He tied his MVP season. I'm surprised he didn't win it. All rookie first team, Dula Curry is... I'm, I'm going to stop saying Dula Curry. I'm just going to I'm gonna start saying me. I'm going to start saying me. I don't know why I'm talking to myself in third person. It's weird. Uh, so I'm, I'm all rookie first team and the Celtics finished as a four seed. We've been dealing with injuries all year long. Jalen Brown broke his right leg. He dealt with the injury earlier in the video. Bro's going through it. We averaged 20 points though, uh, six reefs, four assists, and we shot very efficient. 50% from the field. And how many threes did we make? 194. I'll take that considering the circumstance. We were injured. We, we came in the league late. That's fine with me. We shot efficient. We got 56 steals and 66 blocks, which is impressive. Um, I didn't see that coming, but we had to win our first chip. Up against the Knicks in round one, not tripping off them. We end up beating them in five. We're up against the first seed Cavaliers. Again, I'm not tripping off Cleveland. Maybe I should, though. It's 3 1. And hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, 3 2. And we're going to a game seven. You can see the last game, I shot horrible from a three. I shot two for 13. Bro, what? That's not supposed to happen at all. But we got blessed. We still won. So game seven against this Cavaliers team. They're looking legit in real life. I've been watching some uh, Cavs games. I like Donovan Mitchell a lot, bro. They have a good team. And okay, two-point game. Let's hop in. Drew Holiday on the fast break, starting it off. And he draws a foul. Cool. Wow, he missed the first free throw. Good stuff, Drew. Just don't miss the second one. And it's a one-point game. Oh, wait. I'm stu I'm my, my fault, y'all. Again, it is 3.56 a.m. Um, we're up by three. We actually were not down. So Mitchell with the rock. You know he can shoot from anywhere. And he's going to attack Al Horford. Okay. Al Horford is clamping that up, though. Good steal by Porzingis. Are right, we running. I'm running. Should I shoot it? I'm going to give it to Drew Holiday instead. He's going to attack. Euro stepping in. He blew it. He got three. Back out to Doolin. I got to stop saying that. Back out to me. I could body him. I'm 6'5", bro. Garland is like 6'1". What am I going to do? Spin move. Attacking, forcing it up with the left hand, and that ugly shot somehow goes in. If we get a stop in this possession, I, I, I'm safe to say it's game, right? Drew Holiday clamping up, like what I'm seeing. Al Holford, they can't score. Donovan Mitchell, big three by Mitchell, bro. So I got to come back with a three of my own. I pass it to Tatum for some reason, and they're going to follow him. As long as he makes this free throw, let's see if, if this game is scripted. Let's just see. I'm telling you right now, if Mitchell or Garland hits a three, or even worse, not one of them hit a three. If it's like Jared Allen, the game is scripted for, for the Cavs to win it. I'm going to tell you right now. Good pass in the paint to Mobley. And he, okay, he hit it. It was heavily contested. 20 seconds left, and it's going to be Drew Holiday at the free throw line. He missed one earlier, but he's clutch, right? I mean, he won a chip before. There we go. He knows what it takes to win. In the game seven, he hits both. And the Cavs have no timeouts, but there's still 18 seconds left. They could pull the three real quick and foul. Mitchell contested and hey, that was so close. If that went, bro, I almost thought it was scripted for a second. But nah, we ended up getting the job done. And I had 29 points. Okay, 
not bad at all. So just like that, we're in the conference finals against the Pacers. And speaking about the Pacers, bro, Tyrese Halliburton been cooking up in real life. But I think he's injured. Yes, sir. He is out for four weeks with a dislocated left padula. So that is a huge help for us because we also have Jalen Brown out and Derek White. Everyone's getting injured. It's tough. But we should sweep him still. Hold on. 2-2. Two, 3-2. Two, two, and we win it in six. I should also set a, a goal to break the all-time playoff uh, threes made. I'm, I'm, I'm trying that as well. But we're up against the Grizzlies in the finals. We're all healthy. Grizzlies are healthy as well. All right. Let's win our first ring. We take game one. Uh, Jalen Brown came in doing his thing. Game two, they take it. Bain had 35. All right. Next game, we take that one. I had 29. I went six for nine. Nice. And 2-2. Two, two. Wait a minute. We're down 3-2. Oh, shoot. All right. Moment of truth. Simulate through game. Are we going to a game seven? Yes, we are. All right. Brown had 31. I had 26. This is it right here. Another game seven to win our first ring as a rookie. This is the best team to do it at. So far, Grizzlies had the lead. We get it back. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we got it. We got it in the bag. Boom. I dropped 33 in the game seven. I hit seven threes. And just like that, we win our first ring in Tatum as finals MVP. Good start to the video. I like it. The question is though, are we gonna re-sign to Boston or where are we going next? And we're back. We signed a three-year, $100 million deal. So we're gonna be with Boston for a minute. I'll take it, bro. That should help us get our rings. So in year number two, how is Steph Curry doing? Just comparing to Curry, you know, our idol. He is a 96 overall still. He has two more years left on his contract. So he's still gonna run it up, right? Like he's he might get to 4,000. Let's just see. Currently, he's at 3,800. He will get to 4,000 by the end of his, uh, his career. So we got to beat that. And I feel like while we're at it, we should also aim to be, you know, a top five uh, points at all time. I'm surprised Curry is not up here. How is he not up here? That's really crazy to think about that Curry's not, because he, I mean, threes are worth more than twos, you would think. I mean, Curry's, okay, 29th, I guess. I guess with all the injuries, but still. Yeah, we should aim to be a top 10 score of all time as well. I think we'll do that as well. But let's go back to back and let's, let's win that MVP while we're at it. Next season, Ja wins MVP. Ron Hound, Rookie of the Year. I got to do some research on him, bro. I know he's out of high school. What's... Oh. Uh, yeah, is he is he in the G League? I wonder what... Or is uh, NBA Ignite? Whatever the heck that Scoot Henderson was in. Where's he at right now is my question. Uh, Bradley Beal, Sixth Man of the Year. Chat, Defensive Player. That's impressive. And then Bones is most improved. Trey's clutch player of the year. All right, man. Well, uh, are we all NBA? Absolutely not. But Curry is. Hey, my boy Kate is. Love to see that. So I just saw myself be all defensive second team. Hold on. Yeah, I just saw that. That was really weird. I didn't touch his defensive stats for real. But I'll take it, man. Second team all defense. Year number two, we averaged 21, 6, and 5. Now, how many threes did I hit this time? 278. Bro, I'm telling you. We're going to be on pace if we stay uh, at this rate to um, break the record. So that's a good sign. Did we hit the most in the league this season? I also want to compare that. So player stats. League leaders and three-pointers made. No, not even close, bro. Lillard crushed it. 372. I forgot. Yeah, he is, he is really good from three. Uh, but he's also, what, 34 years old. We're good. We're top 10. Is that Jalen Green behind us? Yeah, Jalen Green. Lamella Ball, okay, okay, fair enough. I'll take it, I'll take it. Tyrese Maxey, if you missed the video a couple days ago, give him Hall of Fame potential. That was a banger, go check it out. But uh, yeah, so Steph Curry's still doing his thing before he retires, I respect it. And we're back in here as a fifth seed, up against Toronto Raptors. You know, Raptors looking pretty solid with Scotty uh, Barnes and all of them, but he's injured. He's out for the season with a ruptured left Achilles. Pascal and OG and Newby, I don't think that's gonna be an issue. And Russell Westbrook, okay, yeah. Hey, man, Westbrook is, a, is an angry enough person. You put him in the cold, he's going to kill someone. I mean, it, it, the winter is here. It's the worst time of the year. Actually, like, I actually like the winter a lot. I just hate the cold wind. Cold wind is like the worst thing ever because like you, you feel really uncomfortable. I hate it. But anyway, we're up against the Cavaliers once again. So let's simulate this round. Oh, my God. 3-1. Bro, why did we get beat so bad? We were healthy too. There's actually no excuse for that whipping, bro. That's weird. Mitchell and Garland both dropped 42, like 42 and 41, like LeBron back in 2016 and Kyrie. God damn. Hate to see it. So this season, we do not end up winning the ring. It goes to the Cavaliers. Darius Garland wins one. I wonder if 2K gasses up this team a little bit too much. I don't know. Have they really proved anything just yet? 
It's all based on potential, I guess. But LeBron retires with the Pistons. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, LeBron. Man, what, 15 years too late, buddy? <laughs> Bro, that would be amazing if he went to the Pistons. That's tough, though. Why did he retire in Detroit, weirdo? That's so weird. Like, that's the last place he'll retire. Detroit? This is weird. I mean, I'm a Detroit. I mean, I guess... No, no. He doesn't even like Dan Gilbert. Because, you know, Dan Gilbert, he's the Cavs owner. You know, doing with LeBron since day one. But I don't think they like each other. But then Dan Gilbert actually runs business over here in Detroit. Like, he's kind of fixing up the city. So maybe he's doing, like, a... I don't know, bro. I don't know what I'm saying. All right, next season, I don't know how we've been able to keep this team together. Like, I feel it's it's expensive, bro. Tatum on a quarter billion deal. Jalen Brown on a quarter billion deal. Me on a $70 million deal. Porzingis making 30. Even Derek White's getting paid good money. Drew's getting paid a bag. Bro, salary cap is on. I, maybe it's our lack of a bench that is... It's not even that bad, though. Bro, that's so weird. I mean, like, I'll take it, but there's no way... I mean, who owns this team? Who owns the Boston Celtics? Isn't it like Robert Kraft? It doesn't even show the owner. It shows the governor, but it doesn't show the owner. How do you find the owner? Oh, it shows the team finances. So the current revenue we're making is 279 million. But yeah, look at our expenses, bro. We're, we're, we're making almost a half a billion dollar loss this season alone. Bro, there's no way that's sustainable. That's crazy. Yeah, the luxury tax, $367 million in luxury tax. Bro, that's, that's insane. I, I just want a million dollars. And, and we're talking about 367 of them. Damn. All right, I'm really hoping Curry gets injured this season because, yo, the more he drops, the, the more we got to chase him. So, hey, year number three, let's cook up. Next season, Curry ends up All-NBA second team. How is he getting better as he ages? I don't know. Like, that's actually kind of crazy. And Dula Curry, All-Defensive second team once again. So, hey, age 23, we actually have a pretty good resume. Uh, and the Warriors are... The seventh seed, they're in the play-in. Let's just see if they actually make it real quick. No, they lost. Wait, they they won it. Yeah, yeah, they won it. So we're the third seed. Warriors are the seventh seed. It will be dope to face each other in the finals. How did how did I do? This season, I averaged 22, and I shot the best from three this season. How many did I hit, bro? 266. Man, that's not going to cut it. At this rate, it's just not going to cut it, bro. You know, I, it's because we're playing with ball-dominant players. Once we uh, leave this team, it'll become better. So we got to make sure that happens soon. I'm going to try to get my ring this season, and if I can, I'm going to leave because I, I, it's, it's going to affect my uh, shot attempts and, and how I play. So this uh, playoff run looking pretty good up against the Cavs once again. And 2-2. Two, two. Dang it. No. Damn, we lost in six. Bro, that's, these should be easy wins. We have a dream team. Evan Mobley, though, he's cooking up on us, man. Damn. So Cavs go back to back. It's whatever. And Curry still hasn't retired. Clay retired. You would think he'd wait for Curry and then retire with him. And then same with Draymond. Draymond is like codependent on Steph Curry. It's kind of crazy. So I have one year left on this deal. So I'm, I'm just going to play out this one last season with the Celtics, see if we can get one more championship run. And then I'm probably going to sign with someone else. I don't think Celtics are going to keep paying us if we can't, you know, win, win chips. But uh, Curry, double checking on him, he is still a 94 overall. So he's gonna he signed a two more a two-year deal contract. So he's gonna be playing until he's 40. Just stacking up the numbers, bro. He's currently at 4,400. I don't bro, it's gonna be very, very tough to even get close to this, man. I don't know if we could do it. Other goals I do want to hit is uh in this video is most threes made in the game with 14. I want to pass that for sure in a simulation game. Same thing in the playoffs with 12. And in the season with 402. I think throughout this time we will do it. So year number four, let's keep adding it up though. Joker wins MVP in 2027 and okay, okay, Chet Holmgren, he's gonna be one of the best defenders the league has ever seen. Maxi Clutch Player of the Year, he's gonna be a superstar, bro. But is Dula Curry gonna be one? No, Steph Curry is not Mr. All-NBA. Uh, and we finally don't make all defensive. So the Celtics finish off as the third seed. How did we do? This season, I was 23. All right, how many threes did I make? 283 so that's the most we made uh that's a good thing honestly because look if tatum is averaging 24 brown's averaging 21 i'm averaging 23 poisoning was 16 this is just too much points i'd rather be on a trash team chucking them up you know jordan pool type beat that's, that's kind of what i want to be uh that's gonna give us the best chance in my opinion but like i said we have other challenges this video uh needs to get done so round one should be an easy 4-1 no okay 4-2, we're up against the Pistons. Hey, man, not right now, Detroit. 
Not right now, Cade. Game seven. Come on. Fingers crossed. We take it. And if Cleveland beats us again, I'm going to be pissed. Tatum's out for the season. Torres left ACL. It's my time to cook up. I got to carry. And I will. Right? No. 3-1. Damn. Wow. I mean, it is what it is at this point. It's a rematch of the finals. And Shea Gilgis ends up winning the finals MVP. That's fine. Whatever. Curry still has not retired. He has one more year left. His brother retired, though. In the moment of truth, we're going to, you know, fast forward next season and see what team I end up signing with. Hopefully, it's a trash one. I'm, I'm, I can't believe I'm saying that, but yeah. All right, I am not with the Celtics. Tatum's going to be out for the entire season still. So, yeah, that injury definitely messed them up. So, let's guess, man. Where did I end up? Uh, I'm hoping... Imagine I end up on the Warriors. No. Ooh, let me guess. Let me guess. The Spurs, I wouldn't have mind, but we're not there. No. Ah, the Brooklyn Nets. I literally got exactly what I asked for. That's that's perfect. Nets suck. No, literally, that's amazing. No. Hey, Cam Thomas is going to steal my shots. I'm trading, bro, immediately. I don't care. He's going to be taking stupid shots. Nope. I like Cam Thomas, but not right now, bro. I do not need him taking any any uh shots. Let's get him out of here. We have 10 offers. I'm telling you, I don't care who it is. I will take it. Uh, we could get some dick. Pause. Or we could get uh, AJ Griffin. Small forward yeah sure no wait no they take shots i want someone that literally does not shoot bro it's that simple i'll take perry graves literally he's a rookie i believe yeah i'll take that that's what i'm willing to do just so i can get more shots up and, and have a higher chance to, to to you know succeed in this video so with that being said now the rotation is me at point guard and then everyone else is trash let me just simulate the first couple weeks and just see how it looks. Well, after the first, like, what, six or seven games, uh, I'm everyone's actually feeling good. I'm averaging only 17 points. Wait a minute. This is not supposed to happen. Only 19 threes made. I'm going to make sure my tendencies are all, you know, good to go. Okay, so kind of auto-adjusted where I take my shots, like the location. Oh, my hot zones. Uh, let me make all of them hot. I almost forgot to do that. That's very important. Call it cheating. I don't care. This is, I'm just, I'm literally just trying to set them up for success. And when it comes to tennis, we already checked that. Attributes. Okay. Badges also. I think I gave Hall of Fame. Yeah, Hall of Fame badges for outside scoring. There's no excuse, bro. It's your world. This season, I'm expecting a lot. Barbara Ingram, executive of the year. There we go. Bro, remember, uh, what was her face? Oh my God, it was a crazy one. She looked like Al Weezy, the executive of the year. You guys remember from video like a couple weeks ago, bro? Dude, I forgot her name, but nah, that 2K face cam was insane. She was fucking ginormous, bro. But nah, Barbara Ingram looks solid. You know, I would rate her a seven, eight, you know, eight and a half, nine, possibly. Okay, are we all on VA yet? Dula, please? No? Damn, bro. We, we are struggling, all right? That's the, all defensive stuff is cool, but that's genuinely not the point of the video, like at all. Uh, so the Nets, we are not in the playoffs or the play-in. We stunk, but we only averaged 18. Oh my God. Yo, yo, that is not right. We made 253s. Okay, so 1,280 over five years. Do the math four times that. So in 20 years, nah, bro. We're not on pace, I don't think. I, th I don't think we're on pace. Let's just see the record real quick. Look, Curry crossed 5,000. 5,100. So, hey man, this is an issue. Curry needs to retire this season or else we are in deep trouble. Also, I gotta fix my player. I don't know why he's playing so bad. Um, that's a huge issue. And the Thunder are probably gonna win out the rest of the video, to be honest. They have a dream team. Curry, he retires. All right, bet. So he played in 19 seasons. So, and what's crazy really, okay, how many seasons really counted in terms of him making threes? Uh, he's, I would say, Okay, one, one, two, two seasons. So 17 real seasons. In the first few, he didn't do so well, but he picked it up. So we got to pick it up. Basically, we have 17 seasons to average at least 300 or else we are not going to break it. Yeah, the issue is, so we are, we're here for two more years. The issue is, bro, this guy dropped more points than us, 20 points. That's not supposed to happen. Maybe there's something in the, in the playbook or game plan, coach game plan, uh, for Dula, is there a way I can, I can make it where the offense runs through us? Like, what's, like, matter of fact, is there a playbook I could choose? Yeah, edit playbook. I gotta unlock it. Oh, I gotta unlock it. No. Oh, the issue is, I'm only getting 33 minutes a game. 
Now, I want to play 40, at least 40 minutes a game. So when it comes to that, that is something I can change. Uh, so I'll make sure I, I give him max minutes available. And now it's 2029, and Webinyama wins his first MVP. Bro, I feel like he's going to win it in 2027. I'm just going to, you know, I'm calling it right now. And then Cooper Flag ends up winning six man of the year. So if you guys want to see a Cooper Flag simulation, you know, probably next year I'll do it when he's more hype. I'm definitely down to do that, bro. Been watching him, a lot of highlights, uh, just his training. He's, he's scary, bro. He's going to be good. Now, Dula is still not all NBA, bro. We got Liam McNeely, a freaking bot. Really? Really? Okay. Well, the Nets, we made the playoffs. We're the third seed, which is impressive. How did we do? I averaged 21, but again, that's not that's not really good. We ended up making 346 threes. And now you're wondering how? Well, look, I use my brain. Tendency wise, this stuff was a little too high. So I put it back down so bro just only focuses on shooting threes. And it worked. It worked. So 346. We're gonna break Curry's uh, season record for sure. But we gotta win an MVP, you know, get a, a three more chips. Got to work out for ourselves. We get 4-1 here by the Hawks, which is insane. And the Cavs and Thunder. This is like the Cavs and Warriors. I mean, these battles are crazy. Shea has won what now? That's like his fourth? Third. Bro, this is unreal. And now Kevin Durant retires. So I'm curious where Kevin Durant ranks in all-time threes. He definitely has to be the most for a seven-footer. Uh, Durant is 13th. That's surprising. Very surprising, but I think he is the tallest player on this list, unless, no, yeah, it is him, by far, actually. The next tallest player on this list is who? Lloyd Markkinen, who's still currently in the league. I thought Dirk, yeah, Dirk with almost 2,000. That's crazy. But uh, all right, we're on the right track now. And now I'm wondering, I mean, even if I was on a good team, would I still be making that many threes? I think so. I think just fixing that tendency thing where I shoot less close shots in mid ranges and only threes, will make the biggest difference. So yeah, age 27, I, we did enter the league at 21 years old, keep in mind. So I didn't enter the league at 18 years old. I made it a little bit more challenging by starting at 21. So keep that in mind. But uh, yeah, we have about you know 13 more years if we're lucky. If we're lucky. So we gotta lock in. There we go, about time Shea wins MVP. I was gonna say, he, he definitely deserved one uh, way before this, but yeah, he gets his MVP. I just can't believe that we haven't been all NBA, bro, at all. Yeah, we're the first seed in the East. How? I guess we got some good pieces. We have depth. Yeah, we have a whole lot of 80 overall players. So this season, this season, come on now. What I average? Tell me I average 23. Okay, 24. I like that. 24. And did we break the record for most threes? Yes, 426. We're back in business, man. We are back in business, man. We end up doing it, bro. We end up getting the most threes in a season. 426. You love to see it. So, uh, hey, we end up doing that, but we still have a lot more to do. Where are we at currently in the all-time list? Are we even? We're 39th. All right, at 2,000. Oh, bro. Okay, we're only 3,000 shy. So let's do the math. Let's let's predict when this is going to happen. So 3,000 divided by 400, that's like seven more seasons or eight more seasons. All right, bet. Eight more seasons, but it's not just that. We have to end up winning those rings. Right now, we're only at one ring. We haven't won an MVP. I don't know if we're going to, to be honest, but the bare minimum, we got to win our rings. So round one, we win that one. Next round, we take that. The Magic, we take them. And now it's up to, uh, to beat Shea. 2-2. Two, two. We have a series. 3-2. And we do it. Hey, man. Ding Patel. What? <laughs> That's an Indian name. The Patel Brothers, man. Shout out to Patel Brothers, bro. I'll be going there sometimes to get my uh, biryani. But yo, Ding Patel. Ends up winning finals MVP over us. Okay, he had 36, but I mean, that's cool. Hey, a chip is a chip, and that's number two. So I'm not going to lie to you, bro. I had Taco Bell earlier today, bro. And for some reason, they, they had poisoned the beans that they gave me because my stomach been killing me. I'm going to simulate eight seasons to the future. I'm going to come back. I'm going to, you know, head to the, to the restroom. I'm going to come back eight seasons in the future, and we'll see if we end up getting to it. All right, so fast forward. The Taco Bell is out of my system completely. You know, shout out to kombucha juice. You know, kombucha juice is a probiotic. It gets your whole, you know, if you know, you know. I'll talk about it more in another video. But Dula Curry is age 37 now, so we played a total of 17 seasons. And I must say, man, I'm pretty sure we broke the record. I haven't checked yet. But here's what we've done in his career. We ended up winning six NBA championships. No MVPs, but we surpassed Curry and Chips, which I will take. 
Now for the moment of truth. So he's 37 years old, the Bulls are not in the playoffs, or we lost in the conference finals actually. But moment of truth, did we break the record? I honestly do not know. And three pointers, boom! Yes we do. 5,300, so we beat Curry's record by only 200. And that's by like literally manipulating it and trying our best. So we end up overtaking Steph Curry's record of uh, 51-11. So we pulled it off, man. It took a lot. And in terms of other records that we broke, did we also get most points in the career? Most threes in the game we got, we got with 15, so we reached that goal. Most playoff threes, we did not. We were fourth with 10. And then obviously most threes in the season, multiple times. Yeah, we did that in 2030. And then in terms of points, I want to see where we rank in terms of uh, points in a career. We got to be up there, right? Curry's 10th. He retired at 10th. And yours truly is 38th. So, yeah, not, not very well, which it is what it is. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to retire at this point. Moment of truth. And yes, I officially retire. Hey, got the job done. And we just barely did it because that he like he was going to retire either way. So we just got the job done in the last season. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it, man. Comment down below what you want to see next. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.